All right, what's up, YouTube? Squat Don here, and um, in this video, I'm going to take you guys just into my own personal training. And I haven't shown you any of my training footage in some time, so we're gonna do that. So I'm gonna do what I really want to do is some pull-ups. I've been doing pull-ups like twice, so we already want to do some pull-ups, some ring dips, some rows, and maybe some tries and buys after. Just a little touch-up, you know. But yeah, I'm gonna try to, like give you like a whole hour footage maybe 40 minutes something like that but yeah that's gonna do my thing y'all watch and you know that's it Alright, so that was like, that was like, I don't even know how much pull-ups that was, but I'm going to do my normal three grips, pronation, supination, and neutral on the rings. So I'm going to do two sets, two sets each. For each grip, I'm gonna see how those two sets feel, and most likely I'll do three sets. But yeah. Alright, that's my first, first two sets, and I feel that right. As I said before, as, as tall as I am, I enjoy the low bars, because I can adjust my grip before I get up. But, yeah. So my resting time, this is how I like my resting time. However long the set took me, say the pull-ups took me 15 seconds. I rest for 15 seconds, or maybe even 30 seconds. You know what I'm saying? But first time is 30 seconds, sometimes a minute. Yeah, I'm not resting more than. It all depends. You know what I'm saying? It all depends. Alrighty, I'm gonna go to the chin-ups. I'm gonna turn around next to it. In the back? Yeah. Oh yeah, I thought it was the front. <laughs> Get her on the camera. <laughs> 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 she 
She said I should get the back. Yeah. So I'm gonna get the back for the next set for y'all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. His muscles are more defined than that. Oh, I didn't think she Oh, I'm <laughs> Alright. It's Guap Don on YouTube. Guap? Guap Don, yeah. Okay. D O N. Yeah. Okay. G U A P. Yeah, okay. and Don. Gotcha. Alright, make sure you subscribe to me. I will. Alrighty. For sure. Alright, comment too so I know who you are and I could. We can go back and forth. Okay, cool. Alrighty. It's great lava. I want to start one for my daughter. Yeah. She, she loves YouTube. Alright, do it. Do that. So I'm going to comment that way you can give me tips. Alrighty. <laughs> Alright, she's saying we gotta get the back. But that look more. Look more better. Alright, let's run it. Seconds. Second. Alright guys, so now we're going to do some neutral grip knee sit pull-ups. Alright, so the first four sets we did was one leg out, one leg in, but these two legs are going to be all the way in. Alright, I do those really really slow because those are my strongest grip despite it being on the rings. The new shows is my strongest so I try to like when I go up I'll be hanging out there up sometimes and then when I come back down make sure I come to a complete dead hang. See? This type of this type of routine will build you up nice, get you real aesthetic and stuff. You like that angle from there? Yeah. I don't know if you saw what I was doing right there. My wrist was sitting on top of the the rings a while ago. That helps me to go a bit higher, but wrist is too tired to do that right now. Like when I'm like here, I feel like I use less forearms, which is weird. But when I come all the way down here now I feel like I gotta engage a lot more forearms.
Alright guys, so now we're going to the ring push-ups, which are my favorite. So I want to do one ring push-up, one ring roll. That's one set. One ring push-up, one ring roll. We're doing we're doing um six sets. I'm not counting the push-ups. I would be doing ten on the on the what's it called? Ten on the rows. Set right there. That was the first set, now second set. I was, I was really exaggerating the slowness of that set. It didn't have to be that slow. I was just so into it. Alrighty. Super lead ring roll. If you want, you can come up some more if you want. I'm trying to be very careful so I don't fall. <laughs> but I'm pulling those rows to my waistline as much as possible. So if you can do that, you can do that. This is my third set. And with these, I'm going to try to have my hands not wrapped. 
just sitting. Make sure I get the grip right first. You know, pushing for six sets, even though I did three quality sets, it's not necessary. I tell myself all the time. So this, this is what I tell myself. I tell myself, all right, three sets. Get it done. Get it done in three sets, not ten sets. Cause why are you doing so much volume for? I'm not saying if you're a volume person, you're a volume person. You know what I'm saying? But you don't like the high volume, then you don't like it. Alrighty, so uh, we have done the pull-ups, some ring push-ups, and some ring rows. And even though I'm working out right now, it feels so off because I gotta be stopping, make sure I adjust the camera and all that stuff. I just want to work. <laughs> Alright, so I'm not even gonna, I'm just gonna go straight into the into the fort push-up type. So now we got three more sets. This push-up, I'm gonna be doing a supinated push-up. This will hit your um, front delt a whole lot and your upper chest. With, with the upper chest, it's just all about your hand placement, you know? So, what you want to do is, um, let me see. Let me, let me show it, let me show it on me right here. So, with the upper chest, I would do the push-ups more so like this. Almost like a tricep push down. You know, if I want to hit my middle chest, come up a little bit more, have my hand placement lined up with the center part of my chest. You know, in the lower, you try and get that hand as close as your, close as your, you know, belly button as possible. And that's how you hit all three heads, upper, middle, lower. You know, I've realized I have 
too much lower pet development. So I've been trying to get that upper pick to come in, you know? So now we're gonna do the rows again, but we're gonna be doing pronation grip. I really wanna go crazy with the row. Well, I don't want to fall, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to fall for y'all either, so. <laughs> get, 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 it, get it from the, the back, baby. So they can see the... I'm enjoying these, but I want to go just a tad bit lower, just for my level, but it feels good. Listen, I can't really go in there forward because I don't want to fall. Alrighty. This push-up doesn't require too much rest because it's not so hard. Like the, the first one I was doing, I got to go down, control, everything. I enjoy doing that a lot of my sets. I will pause at the end of the rep knowing that it's gonna be really really hard to come back up but still do it. Woo! Those are so off. <laughs> it feels good. But it's off because I keep adjusting my feet. Alright guys. So this is the last set of push-ups and rows. Hold on, let me adjust my my grip. Because this grip is so weird. I want to make sure it's all good. money right there all right so for the last ring row I'm gonna show y'all something a little different so with this ring row for this ring row I'm gonna be doing a neutral grip with one hand 
on top, like this. I was doing this recently. So I'm gonna do 10, 10 on one, one, one side and 10 next side. So the last thing we're gonna be doing is some body weight biceps and triceps and that's pretty much a wrap all right guys so we're gonna be finished off with some um, some triceps and some biceps so let me show you in the past you know I've been doing the tricep extensions at the craziest level which is all over the ground but some days I just don't want to do it. <laughs> so I've been doing them right here and the just the way it feels, it feels so good, you know? So I've been doing it with my hands placed just like this. It's like this, it's the finger is right on the on the edge. That forces the tricep to work. Alright. So we're going for three sets and I want three quality sets. Alrighty. You see the struggle. <laughs> you see the struggle. Now we're gonna go straight to the biceps. It's like a really really good pump to either start your workout or end it or you can just make it super super hard but I'm not using this as a working set you know just finish it off my workout with a little touch up you know Alrighty. so you can do the, the extensions let me show you two ways when you do it like this way when it comes to your head like this, you get a more long head. All right. When it comes like this now, now you get more lateral head. And you know. So you know when you're working out, be honest with yourself. Do you have too much of this? Work on. The lagging body parts. <sighs> Ooh. Do some single arm biceps.
I almost set this by this triceps. That's pretty much the workout for today. We did some pull-ups, some push-ups, some rows, some rows in the back, did some triceps, stuff like that, and some biceps, you know. And that's pretty much it guys. So if you like this video, don't forget to drop a like, comment subscribe all that good stuff become a member of my patreon the patreon link will be in my description if you want to learn some of the body weight moves like the l-sit pull-up how you can progress faster in calisthenics how to get aesthetic how to stay lean all that stuff i have it on my patreon and the link will be in the description follow me on my instagram on guap down on guap down vegan for vegan tips vegan ideas vegan recipes all that good stuff until next time guys i'm gonna catch you in the next video what do you think the biggest lesson you learned so far, period, in life. Yeah. Don't take everything so serious. Um, try to be nice to everybody that you can. It don't pay to be mean. It don't pay to like, uh, anybody, can, anybody can be an asshole. Anybody can be racist. Anybody can be a bigot. Anybody can be prejudiced. You know, but try to like be tolerable. Try not to be judgmental. That's my, 